Dynamic or high efficiency milling is very popular right now. It achieves good metal removal rates, good tool life, and is becoming easier to program due to cam system updates. However, the tooling required is very expensive and is very limited in depth to the flute length of the end mill. We're going to show you a different approach, one that is not limited in depth and is much more cost effective due to the use of a carbide insert versus a carbide end mill. Let's take a look. High feed ramping is simply profile milling any typical two-dimensional shape, but with a simultaneous ramp in the Z-axis. Most cam systems offer this approach as a standard tool path. The depth of cut is light, but the feed rate is typically hundreds of inches per minute, achieving great metal removal rates that are very competitive with dynamic milling, but without the high tooling cost. A worn cutting edge is simply indexed rather than needing replacement like a carbide end mill. Since high feed ramping is an axial directed cut or into the spindle, it is not limited by tool length in the way that dynamic milling is limited by the cutter flute length. This makes the high feed ramping approach very attractive for deep pockets or profiles like you see here. Here's a comparison of efficiencies when machining a typical pocket. We start with a solid carbide end mill running dynamic tool path and compare it against high feed ramping with both an indexable end mill and shell mill. The shell mill finishes very quickly, machining the pocket in just one high feed ramping pass. Now the indexable end mill is smaller than two times the pocket width, so we machine both an inside and outside high feed ramping tool path to bring that one to size. It still finishes more quickly than the solid carbide end mill being run with dynamic tool path and it costs much less to operate. Now, if we had doubled the depth of this pocket, the solid end mill would not have been able to compete due to its limited flute length. The indexable end mill and shell mill could both have run pockets up to four times the depth of this one with no changes in operating parameters using the high feed ramping toolpath. High feed ramping provides a more cost effective and more capable approach to milling and provides a significant cost savings over solid carbide cutting tools. Contact a DAPRA application specialist today to find out how to implement this strategy in your shop. Reach us at 800-243-3344 or at info at depra.com.